I don't know if you guys can believe this or not, but this is my first day outside in a couple of days since Sunday. I've been in my bedroom for about two days. Deadly, I wanna say deadly, but I've been really, really sick. Um, it feels good to be out here, but I'm extremely cold. It's about 80 degrees out and I have a sweatshirt on. I think today is the road to recovery. Thank the Lord. Kind of just taking it easy. It's been it's been a rough couple two days. I actually didn't think I was gonna make a post today. I might even take it easy tomorrow. Um, today's the opening of Flower and Garden, and as you guys know, I'm always at the openings of pretty much everything. Disney. I just I haven't eaten in a couple days, and you know, Flower and Garden is kind of all about food the topiaries, the atmosphere. Um, hopefully I'll be able to eat something today, but I decided maybe to go to Flower and Garden when I'm full health, I'm actually finally eating. Um, so I elected not to go to Flower and Garden today and I apologize for that. But I really have not been in the best health. I'm pretty sure I'm feeling a little bit better, a little better now. I've been in my bed for for days. Um, we first started out with severe stomach aches. I, uh, I was I was throwing up. As soon as I got home from Wisconsin the next morning, it kind of just hit me and I was feeling extremely lightheaded. I tested negative for COVID, so don't, don't worry about that. I've been testing every day for COVID. Um, it's not COVID, um, but I do feel better. I don't have any body aches. I still feel a little a little sick like I am gonna throw up sometimes um, I haven't been able to eat anything since Sunday it hasn't stayed down same with water um, at least I am kind of walking around you know even though I do have a sweatshirt on when it's 80 degrees out like I said it all started on Sunday but really Monday morning I don't know really what it is I don't think it's food poisoning from what I ate on Sunday but it's been absolutely miserable. I don't know if it had anything to do with the water park. I think it's something that I picked up at the water park. I was researching it. Pepmo Bismo, I believe it's called, has extremely helped me. My chest hurts when I breathe right now. Like, I think that's from, from throwing up. Um, I think it's called the norovirus. I think that's the virus that I have um, because I think that's what's going around. It's If that's what I have, it's terrible to have. I hope no one ever gets it. Um, literally shivers. It felt like um, the flu to me. And oh my God, it was so bad. Shivers, trembles, throwing up. Not I would literally try to eat crackers and applesauce. It would come up in 20 minutes. TMI, I know. Um, but anyways, uh, check this out. This is beautiful, right? It's very peaceful, especially right now, because I feel like everyone is at work, except they are cutting the lawn. It's very nice, very nice out. Anyways, I've actually lost, I think about five to eight pounds. I mean, I haven't eaten in two days. I'm gonna try to get something down today. And again, the main reason why I haven't, I, I, I don't wanna go to Flower and Garden because I don't want to eat something and then feel the urge to, you know, do what I've been doing these past two days. I've really, been really sick. Um, didn't really expect this, obviously. I mean, no one really expects to get sick. Um, so this is going to be kind of like a sit, sick vlog, more of an update. Um, yeah, I was a little bit ahead in the video, so I had Monday and Tuesday off, which was thankfully nice. Otherwise, there was not going to be any videos at all. I don't know if I'm going to post tomorrow either. Um, still up in the air on on that, but I do feel like I'm on the road to recovery. These last two days have just been absolutely miserable. Um, if any of you guys have had the norovirus, this is self diagnose I'm self-diagnosing myself. I feel like that's what it is. But if any of you guys have had it, um, what have what have you done to to get better, other than than resting um, with my disease? ankylosing spondylitis and Humira that I'm on. 
I usually get hit harder with viruses and colds because my immune system is so is so weak. So it kind of does stink when I get sick because it's so much more intense than than other people, and I get sick pretty often. It's like the first major one that I've had in in a while. It's really kind of just put me down. I'm gonna turn back around and kind of hitting a dent in here, and I like kind of walking here. It's peaceful. No one ever really comes here. So yeah, I think we're gonna kind of just go back in my apartment and I just wanted to update you guys. This might be even it for the video. I just I let you guys know kind of what's what's going on. I put something on Instagram and I said send help. Pedialyte Casey brought me some some good stuff. Jojo went to the store and got me some stuff. But it really hasn't been fun at all. I wish I could go to Flower and Garden, but I just I just can't. Hopefully I'll get something to eat today, do some door dashing, and um, yeah, it's, it's been it's been not fun, not fun at all. But we're back here in Florida, which is nice. I'm going to New York here on on the fifth. Is it the fifth? Should be the fifth. My sister and my mom on the fifth. Yeah, on the fifth. And then they come actually next weekend on, on the 11th. So that's gonna be fun. Casey's gonna finally meet my, my family. I don't know if I'll film that. I don't know, nothing's really off limits for, for what I do. We'll see, I think it'd be kind of cool. But yeah, haven't eaten a couple days. It's been miserable. Oh, it's been miserable. It does smell like freshly mowed grass. I like that. I really like that. I'm getting a little dehydrated. I gotta get something to drink. Hopefully that stays down. They did just repaint our buildings as well. I kind of like it. I don't know. I don't mind it. It's very nice. Thankfully, I am feeling a, a little bit of an appetite. I'm feeling hungry. I haven't felt that in a couple days. I'm just worried that... It's not gonna stay down. I just hate that I'm missing flower and garden. I really do. We'll get there eventually. I think I'm gonna go order something. Just, just rest some more. It's so very hard when you're used to busy go go go, and then you just get sick. In my case, and it just flatlines you. <sighs> yeah. I don't like being in this room anymore. You can kind of see what I've been working with here. This is what Casey got me, and I could only drink a little bit. I've had some saltine crackers, which I got down a couple. But if you guys have what I think I have, this extremely helped me, and it, it it's done wonders. It it really has. Um, I haven't been running a temperature at all. Again, I tested negative every day for COVID, ibuprofen to help for the aches and water occasionally if I can get get that down. Casey got me chicken broth, but I couldn't even look at that without puking. Some of the best tea around, I love orange tea, and this is kind of like my favorite. I don't really like natural tea, but this is some really good stuff, especially when I'm sick and can get it down. I just haven't been able to just because again, I really couldn't get anything down. I do feel a little bit lightheaded at the moment. I'm gonna try to order something on DoorDash here. I don't know. I um, I really haven't eaten anything in a couple days. Like I said, I'm scared. I'm really scared. I honestly feel like I really shouldn't be even be filming a video today. But you guys gotta go to your jobs when you're not feeling good, and so do I. I don't even know what to, nothing looks good to me at the moment, like not one thing. You know when you're sick, nothing looks good. Not one thing. Floridian French toast. Well, I hope it looks like that. Because that looks good. I should really get a code for DoorDash because I honestly don't go to the grocery store. I order my groceries. Or I just order food on DoorDash. Like, this is how I live. This is how I live. 
Alright, it says it's coming in 16 minutes. Gotta love DoorDash, it's... It's so easy, you know. This is legitly gonna be the first thing I eat in, in two days. I got a muffin. <laughs> Doesn't look anything like it's supposed to look. That's fun. I understand. Let's see if I can eat this. Smells good. That's a good thing. I'm gonna start out light just with some kiwi and strawberry. See what happens. It hurts my stomach. Yeah. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to eat this. Ah, oh, it feels weird, guys. It's a shame. I mean, I could put this in the refrigerator and save it for later, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to eat it. Speechless. I don't know. I've never been sick like this. I've never had it where a couple bites and I feel extremely full. <gasps> I definitely made the right decision. I'm not going to flower garden today. I just remembered that Mandalorian season three just came out, so we're gonna we're gonna watch that. Looks like Disney's uh, staying with their one episode releases. One thing I like about Netflix, even though now they just got rid of their sharing, so I really just wish they would drop them all because I would totally watch them all today. Gotta wait till next week. It's a bummer. No spoilers. This is what was on season two. Still watching Mando here, but fun fact, the first two days of this norovirus, supposedly, I couldn't watch anything. Like, I couldn't even lay in bed, like, properly. I was just sleeping all day. It was that bad. Just finished uh, episode one. It was good. Uh, I can't wait for more of them to come out, but I think I'm going to end today's video, everybody. I probably shouldn't get some rest here. I tried playing Call of Duty earlier. I just... I honestly can't. I think I just need some rest. And uh, hopefully I feel up to it tomorrow to make another video. But um, we'll see. We'll see. That's just kind of an update on how I've been doing. And hopefully I get up to, to par soon. So with that, hopefully I'll see you guys tomorrow.